You did not know that such technology existed. Uh, Mary, I, uh, there's a couple of things, but I'm afraid we're going to have to stop dating. <gasps> Why? Because... Well, if you have a real lightsaber, I'm afraid that that's far too advanced for me. Far too advanced. I, I can't keep up. No way. Sorry. But, but you know how to work my Betamax. I guess I'm just a traditional guy. I can't operate my Betamax with well, one hand. You know. That's why I need you. I need you in my life. I, I wish, I wish I could have been your Alpha Max. I really, really do. But Sweet. this is the end. I'm putting. Hey, Flip, just take a little off the top, if you don't mind. I want to just uh, kind of trim it up, you know, make me look nice and clean, if you don't mind. Oh, sure. We're going to get you. We're just gonna get you real good here, but hey, I got a hey. secret. I gotta tell you. I got a secret. I gotta wow. tell you. Okay. I, I'm not. I'm not gonna cut hair anymore. What do you mean? You've been doing this for thirty-two plus. I know, but I got this amazing tape, and it's got all these secrets on it. It's got this trash and everything. I, I'm gonna blackmail some people. And I'm going to just be rich, take off. So wait, you're saying you have a, like, like a videotape of amazing people? What, what, what type of people? They just got all kinds of secrets, you know? They, they, they got things that they don't want to have out, you know, in the world. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to contact them and I'm, I'm going to blackmail them. I mean, what could go wrong? I, I do want you to I don't know, you can, you, can, you, can, you can get caught and go to jail. That would be pretty wrong, depending on who the people are. You haven't sp said who they are, but more importantly, who am I gonna, you've been cutting my hair for 22 years. Well, what am I gonna do? Swipe, swipe, swipe. So we got all these celebrities doing We Are The World, right? And this guy wants all this money before we let this out. What are we gonna do about this, Jake? We can hire an assassin, take him out, search the house. I feel like we're doing this for the better of the world, and yet hire assassins it should be part of our plan there, Jake. We must do the necessary evil to achieve the greater good. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. My mom raised me differently. I, I, can't, I can't do this. You go tell Michael Jackson what's going to happen, okay? You go tell Bono what's happening. Hmm. Maybe I shall hire our best assassin, Cindy Lauper. Yeah? Do you think Cindy's got this? Oh, time after time, she is ruthless. With her love for the world and all the love, she she might be able to do this. You know what? She knows. We should call her. Hmm. Yes, I'll call her. You call her. You let me I'll know. I'll call her. Yes. Hello, Sweet. Cindy Lauper. Cindy. <laughs> nice. Saved. That's saved. That's cool. That's awesome. <laughs> I was going to add that I have a real white tape or two. <laughs> So now do we just mute off? What's happening? All right, now I can eat. I think I'm gonna take my radio off. I don't feel. 
Wait. What's happening? Oh my god, I'm so excited. Seen him in the restaurant. I don't know. I don't know. The Sinu. <laughs> hey, nobody can hear you, man, if you're talking. Mm. Hey, hey, Faustino, I'm going to get that third grader now. They're on their way. That was a pretty good job. I was like, your piano plays very quiet. Hey everybody, can we get a suggestion? Um, maybe a, a line of dialogue that you've heard today? Look at that thing over there. Look at that thing over there. It was. Yeah, I'm, um, I'm muted now. I hope I am because I'm freaking muted. <laughs> no, you're not. You are definitely what? not muted. <laughs> what? What? Look at that thing over there. What is it? What thing? What? That thing is my baby, ma'am. I don't appreciate insults. Yes, it's a baby. It's a child. Oh, it is kind of cute. Yeah, yeah, it is. It has my eyes. It has your, um, it has a couple of your fingers too, I noticed. Mm -hmm. quite, uh, quite advanced for its age. Pretty much full-blown man hands. Gonna be a football player one day. Oh, it is a boy. Oh, oh. Mm -hmm. it's my baby well, boy. I was just thinking that we needed more girls in this world. I was hoping it was gonna be a girl. You're hoping my little boy was gonna be a little girl? Yes, we need more girls in the world. I mean, I can ask him to pretend. Oh, would you? Yeah, I mean, he likes dressing up. I could put a oh. pink bow tie on him instead of a blue one. Oh, that would be so fabulous. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it would be nice. Well, let me uh, let me get it on him. Hold on. Do you mind holding him for a second? Uh, right. Dad, 
this is ridiculous. I feel uncomfortable wearing this sundress. I, I, well, is it the color? I mean, I, it, I, I thought that canary yellow brings out your eyes. Yeah, I I'm, I'm trying to make junior varsity this year. And if you're going to insist that I go to school wearing this, then uh, uh, I'm going to go live with mom instead. Look, this was your grandfather's dress, okay? Uh, we, we, we've, but this has been passed down from generation to generation. I wore this when I on my first day uh, of uh, of my junior year. So I think it's time that uh, you you carry on the tradition. I, I didn't know that this dress actually has a little pocket here. Wait, hey, wait, wait a minute. There's a there's a key. It's like a like an old safety deposit box key. Did Grandpa yes. have any secrets? Uh, tag Lee. Son, yes. I want you to wear this dress and okay. make me proud. All right. Someday this dress will reveal a secret. <laughs> oh. A secret that only you will be able to answer for yourself with this key. Oh, uh, there's a key. What, what does it go to? Is it like a? Is it like a a, a secret uh, treasure chest, or is it like uh, another yes, door to another house? When the time comes. Oh. Cut back. Yeah. So, uh, uh, yeah, you'll you'll eventually, son. You'll you'll eventually uh, learn what this key is for. Uh, I have quite figured it out yet i've tried a lot of different doors some uh some uh padlocks on different bikes around town uh um i i did try it on a couple of uh diaries that i just have happened to find you know laying out in the road uh, uh but uh you know maybe you can figure this out i i haven't figured it out grandpa was in the war but it's secrets Sweep. <laughs> mm. Yes, everything is going according to plan. Oh, oh, good. Oh, good. I'm glad that the plan is uh, is going uh, as planned. I guess. Uh. <laughs> the elixir is complete. Oh, Here, sample I'm, it. Oh, good. Thank you. I am. I am so thirsty. <laughs> oh, could use a nice elixir. Mm. Oh. Do you feel it? In your system? Yeah, I'm feeling gassy all of a sudden. Uh, oh, yeah. It's uh, going to get worse. Uh, it's my like special. Of... Yeah. Hey, boss, I don't know what, what those in that elixir you gave me, but I'm not feeling good. It's my special, special liquid chipotle serum. So you oh, God. Can the side effects without having the full belly. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I'm not feeling good. You're probably going to die now, Nathaniel. It feels like it. Act like a wolf, crawl off into the woods and maybe pass out alone away from the pack. If you survive it, come back. I have more for you for my next batch. Okay. I'd like some elixir. Mm, I got a special one for you. Oh, good. Okay. Can you hand yeah. it over? Yes, here you go. Drink it, yes. Mm. I call this one Crystal Pepsi. Oh, it's it's a bit effervescent, but it's uh, it's oh wait a minute, hold on, I can see your diary. <laughs> you see my diary? Yes, I see that you were talking about your child yes yeah. that you were trying to say to that little boy that he wanted he needed to grow up too quickly he did and he grew up gave him a special serum to grow up and then he left me and he told me dad i never ever want to see you again Oh no, he's 
Uh, all right, team. We got to find a new beverage that's going to sell to all the kids. All right. All right. Yeah. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Huge failure. Right. Just did a whole lot of color. I'm ready. What? All right. Uh, Surge, popular for a little while, then not so much. Okay, soda. Mm, okay. It's okay. Looking for ideas, looking for big team, big sellers, something people want to drink. We thought hey, about boss, I, no. I just want to apologize for the licorice juice idea. It was stupid. Thank you for not firing me. Thank yeah, you. You're welcome. Uh, nobody wants to have fizzy licorice in their mouth. Hey, 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 how about this? How about this? Everybody loves pizza. What if we have a pizza flavored soda? That's the idea. Mm -hmm. That's love the it. idea. Yeah. yeah. I love that idea, except it sounds terrible. People want to wash pizza down with a beverage. People don't want to wash. Great. Uh, if we add anchovies to the pizza soda, I think it'll be a winner. You're just taking a bad idea and making it worse. You're just taking a bad idea and making it worse. I think we should put pineapple I don't like, I don't like in the pizza soda. It would make it much better. All right. See? Tropical. This tropical pizza soda. This Ooh. is what I'm talking about. This is a million dollar idea. Tropical pizza. You can add other fruits too. Why stop at pineapple? You could add cherries. Uh, you could add uh, cranberries, apples. blueberries. You could add kale, branded <laughs> as a health drink. Yeah, it's okay, like no a mixture. No one. It's at like all. some sort of concoction. No, nobody likes kale. Even people no. that pretend, even vegans, don't like kale. Look, at you, right there. You haven't said a word. Maybe. Yeah. Me? Yeah. No, you've said enough. You? You. Damn. Which one? Yep. Uh, am I fired? Uh, do I, do I have a you with the guitar. Him. You gotta have a jingle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm talking to you. Well, that's really weird because I'm not part of your group, but that's all right. I just stand oh, okay. up like, and the whole time. Maybe so you I, have I, I can just that. scheme in on you. you know, I, well, here's a little something I just came up with. Yeah, go for it. Yeah. Uh, drink this and die. Drink this and die. I, I don't know if that's the group yeah. you're looking for or not, but it's just, uh, like I said, I'm not part of your troop. It's just, I'm just that's playing around exactly here. exactly the edge we're looking for. Is what okay, we're all right. It needs to be risky. Yeah. By the way, this is how we all talk in Greentown, Indiana. Drink it and die. Drink it and die. Yeah, there you go. Sweet. Sweet. <laughs> yeah. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go back to mute, let you all finish. And if you need any other jingles, just give me a holler. Just say, hey, you you with the guitar. Well, welcome to Tony's Pizzeria. May I help you please? Yeah, can I get a motherfucking pizza, please? All right, we got three flavors tonight. We got pepperoni, we got plain cheese, and we got crystal Pepsi. Which one do you want? Oh, I want pepperoni with extra plain cheese crystal Pepsi on the side, please. Can you do this for me in a timely manner, please? I don't have a lot of time. All right, let me see what I got here. Hurry hey, up. Tony, help me out yeah. here. Yeah. Thank you. All right, here you go. Got the uh, you got the pepperoni with extra cheese and a, a, a slice of uh, crystal Pepsi on the side. Real quick, who was that handsome man that just handed you the pizza? Bernie. Well, yeah. I'm, I'm about hey, to I'm, I'm about to fire Bernie. I'm sorry, he doesn't know this yet, but Bernie, I'm sorry, man. I gotta let you go at the end of today's shift. What the hell, man? Hey, I have hey, a wife. Hey, I'm, ne I'm next in line. I need I need to get a, my pizza from Bernie before you fire him because. Because he's my idol. Yeah, there's I, people that need what I do, Tony. You can't do this to me, man. Bernie, Bernie, get all Bernie. I get every day is, who's that handsome guy? Who's that good-looking guy? I'm sorry, I can't have somebody working in here that's better looking than me. Tony, I have a quick question for you. Is Bernie single and on the market? He is. All right. Linda, I'm going to evict you from my pizzeria. I'm telling you, every day it's the same thing. It's Bernie this and Bernie that. But, but Bernie is the only one that knows how to put my anchovies in the right direction on my pizza. You can't get rid of Bernie! 
That's a metaphor. See, see, how long have we been talking about this? I drive the business here. Without me, you're nothing. He's the money maker, Tony. He's correct. You're going to go out of business. The money maker. Well, maybe the money right. maker. Bernie, can you forgive me? Can you please stay with me just for a little bit longer? I don't know. I don't Sweet. know. I have Sweet. Hey, uh, 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 so it says on your uh, application, Bernie Sanchez, um, you used to work, you worked at another pizzeria, huh? I did. Yeah, I absolutely did. Uh, what, makes you think you're, what makes you think you're a good fit for Vinny's pizza, huh? Three things. I am handsome. I am good looking and I am also handsome. So that makes me a perfect fit for this pizzeria. All right. All right. All right. Well, listen, I only hire good looking people. Uh, Absolutely. Oh, oh, you're that guy, huh? That Bernie guy I heard. I, I, me a Tony's pizza. Ah, I yeah. am that guy. I am that yeah. Bernie. I am that Bernie. Yeah. Yeah. Listen, I think we can offer you a way better deal. Yeah. What are you talking about? Way better deal than he's offering. We're going to let you have minimum wage plus tips, plus a free pizza every night, large pizza. See, let me tell you, I was working for free. I was working for free at his, but that is a much better offer. Oh, I way overplayed my hand then. Okay, good. <laughs> I was gonna offer you my Camaro <laughs> next. <laughs> oh God, okay, yeah, I'll, I'll work for pretty much anything at this point. Oh, okay, great, excellent. Well, you, you start Monday, okay? Okay, sweet. Uh, All right. So, um, I appreciate you meeting me. Um, I've got a, a, a new business proposal. Um, it's a hamburger joint, except we don't cook the hamburgers. We give you the patties and the buns and the cheese, and uh, you order that from us, and then you take it home and you cook it yourself. That is exactly what I was waiting to hear. I'm in. Whoa, that was wow. I, I'm sorry, I wasn't, I wasn't expecting that. Like, I, um, I was expecting um, hesitance or uh, someone to tell me that's insane. I <laughs> look like a hesitant type of person. I'm in great. Um, wow, I hey, uh, hey, hey, boss, boss, tell her, tell her that we need an extra 10 grand up front. Yeah. Okay. Again, I will. I will tell her. Uh, I just didn't. I again. I was not expecting it to get th this far this quickly. Um, so we need an extra ten grand up front. Money's yours. Wow. I didn't. I didn't even tell her what it was for. Um, <laughs> it doesn't matter. It, wow. This. It's wow. Okay. Um, boss. 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 Add a zero. Add a zero. To. To the end, right? To the end. We need uh, an extra. Did you tell that voice in the background I can hear everything he's saying? Yes. Uh, yes, I will. Um, uh, she can hear everything you're saying. Um, but that's fine. I mean, this is my number one business advisor uh, right here. And the, the, the big reason why we've gotten this far. So um, tell him to make his face seen. Oh, uh, come here. Don't don't laugh. I just had I just had the uh, just had the face repaired. Tag right, out, so. Sandy. It, it was a skateboarding accident on Fifth Avenue. The I, taxi driver I, came from the left. Tag Sandy. Uh, wow! I can't believe you guys were on Shark Tank. That was really cool. I know. <laughs> And every yeah. single shark gave us an offer. What was it like sitting next to Mark Cuban himself? Uh, it was warm. <laughs> yeah, I heard he's pretty hot. I heard he smells good, too. He smells great, right? Uh, eh, come see, come sa. Was that French? It was. <laughs> Sorry, I only speak American. I'm uh from a small town. Let's see. Nice fast. Nice. Woo! High five, 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 high five.
That was my bad. Hey, hey, I was I was called into the act. All right, let's get that straight. I was drawn into it. Okay, all right. <laughs> I think Maggie did. It's me. Hi, I'm here. Oh, hi, Maggie. Hi. Hello. Oh, my boots. Ooh. Jamie, see again. Ben, 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 Ben. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. That seems to be my style. Sure, I'll jump in. <laughs> <laughs> we forgive you, man. What is this? Kick? This is dodgeball all over again. I'm from. <laughs> I'm from Metro Detroit. If it helps you narrow down the region, Michigan. <laughs> and all my Detroit players. This is very. Oh well, yeah, Michigan, Detroit. Yeah, that's how we go back. <laughs> Oh, wait, are Alex and Sandy, are they playing? Are you guys playing? No, I'm muting my yeah. camera right now. Sweet. Cool. Sandy, you just play. Okay. Got it. Right there. I'm there. I'm right here. There. Yep. Mm-hmm. Wait, did you say you could see me or not? So I see you. I can see you, Brandy. And Sandy, your camera's still on. <laughs> Sandy, Alt V, dude. Michael, I like your pronouns. Oh, thank you. <laughs> what am I hitting? Alt what? Alt A, Alt V. Alt V? Thank you. Oh, no, you're back. Nope, leave. Hey, everyone. We are team three. Woo! Woo! And I have a suggestion of something that brings you a lot of happiness and joy. Kids. K kids? I think the first thing I heard was kids. Kids. So kids. Kid, kids. thank yep. you, kids. Mm -hmm. You just put a period on the end of the sentence. The period, because baby, put the period on the end of the okay, sentence. Okay, okay. Like... You can be bell hooks another time and issue um, you don't punctuation, understand. but you have to learn the rules. Okay. I am too excited for periods, okay? Everything needs an exclamation mark. <sighs> 
<laughs> Leave your sister alone, Sam. Excuse me, Michael. Do you have something you want to say to my face? Okay, well, then I'm going to tell mom that you snuck out last Friday night so you could see a PG-13 movie. Yeah, I heard that. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm, I'm mm -hmm. right here. What are you going to do about it, mom? First of all, ring, ring, you're not going to talk to me like Ring, that. ring, calling Brandy. Ring, 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 ring. Calling yeah, hello? Brandy. He hello. Hi. Hello. Yeah, hi, this is the, hi, this is, uh, this is Randy over at the movie theater and, um, Wanted to make you aware that uh, your son saw mm -hmm. a PG-13 movie last week. Okay. Uh, apparently, uh, he showed up with uh, a bunch of 18-year-olds who uh, okay. vouched for him. And uh, they came okay. in and they saw quick, it. And, quick uh, question, uh, movie theater yeah, manager yeah. guy. Did you know that he yeah. was thir less than 13? Uh, well, uh, yes. Um, yeah, but, well, uh, uh, and you let him in anyway? Well, uh, well. Uh, well Okay. And, and ma'am, ma'am, for, for are you sake still of here? Argument, Why are you still on the phone? Yeah, I, I'm, I'm sight, I'm sight impaired. I, so I really, I didn't even see him. I just, I, he sounded like he was older than that, but I found out later. Okay. Well, thanks for the heads up. I appreciate okay. it. Thank you for parenting right, you, from afar. Thanks. That, thank you. You have a great day. Honestly, mom, I'm going to snoop on Michael every single time. So you don't even need to get these phone calls from managers. Okay. Samantha, nobody likes a snoop. Hey, I am doing the best I can. And when you have children, you will understand that it is not easy, okay? I'm just doing the best I can. And you guys are driving me crazy. Mom, I have three American Girl dolls, okay? Molly, Samantha, and Kirsten. And um, I can take care of them pretty good. So I don't think I need your advice. Okay, guess what? Mom's off duty. <laughs> Sweep, sweep, sweep. So um, I guess what we have to do then is we have to m figure out what movies are PG-13 and what movies are R. R. So I've got uh, this big list of criteria here. Go ahead. Give me, give me five of them. OK. You can see breasts but no nipple. That's PG-13. Oh. Nipple, oh, that's, that's an R. I love that. You see an ass? PG-13. You see genitals? That's an R. Mm. You hear the S word, the D word, et cetera? That's PG-13. You hear the F word? That's an R. Uh, uh, I'm going to need I'm going to need some clarifications as far as uh, now. What if there's an F word in a 13? Is there a different type of F word for PG-13 as compared to the R ones? I mean, it's, could they it's say? The it's the Shoot number of chat. It's the number of times that the F word is said. Uh, yeah, you can sneak okay. in one, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. yeah and one time. And you can't add an ing to it. No. Oh, oh yeah, God. that's true. Yeah, the but er hey, makes guys, it a verb, doesn't it? I don't well, know now. if this is really playing into the criteria, but I find math to be really intimidating. Can we <laughs> incorporate that into it somehow? <laughs> So you're thinking like uh, uh, more math means a higher rating or? Yeah, yeah. Like if someone mentions algebra, maybe that's like a PG-13, something like that. Okay. But and it starts mm -hmm. getting into like trigonometry. I don't know if I'm comfortable yeah, well, with So history. calculus would be an R then. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I mean, at, at least. Oh, yeah. Calculus is, mm -hmm. calculus is 17. Oh, yeah, okay. definitely. Well, okay. 17 plus X anyway. So we got yeah. the geometry on R. The calculus on NC-17 and algebra is PG-13. Yeah, and I'm not even super comfortable like using the full names like all of us right here. So uh, if we could just, you know, tone it down. Because you never know, like kids might be listening at the door or one of us might be two kids stacked on top of each other. Got to be aware of who's around. All right, all right. How about Al That's true. Trig Calc? That's better. Oh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. thank you for sharing. My code name is. Sweet, 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 sweet. 
So as I said, Gary, this is a really lucrative job working at the AMC movie theater. Um, and we're just going to have to take it super seriously. Gary, are you with us? Which Gary? <laughs> Gary S. Gary S. Obviously. Oh, oh I'm super excited. That's great. Well, <laughs> <laughs> Gary, oh you look like hell. You really need to get more sleep before coming into work. What have you been making out with? What's going on? Excuse me. Hello, uh, AMC. I am here to speak to the manager. I need to have a conversation with the manager. If that's yeah, what can, what can I do for you? Yeah, yeah so, so we're co-managers, kind of. Co okay, great. I am officially, as a mom off duty, I will be at your movie theater from sun up to sundown, watching Good. movies, letting my kids fend for themselves, and I want to watch something dirty. I need oh, to be like yes. a beautiful mind yes. level nasty mask. 15 it's colors of magenta mean. it's got all of the colors through magenta all 15 of them it, so well, I, I think the better figure out what you're after what how far did you get with bath in high school i mean i, I just want to see like goodwill hunting matt damon writing all those mm -hmm. disgusting equations on mm -hmm. the board that's that's the kind of stuff i want to mm -hmm. watch Can i see that mm -hmm. that's it I'm yes just, yeah. we've got inside einstein's bedoir it's um, how he calculated uh, while making love. Oh. Oh, no, hell no. <laughs> no. Swipe, 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 swipe. <laughs> okay, but not one of those schoolhouse rock ones again. It's just too sing songy for me. <laughs> Look, can I interrupt? My mom said I can spend the night, but I can't watch anything with rock in it. Oh, rock the devil's you. music. He's kind of one of those like doesn't do Halloween guys, you know. I can hear you, and yeah, I am. Oh, <laughs> I meant for you to hear me. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> Oh, no. Hey guys, I could play. I, I could play. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, M bunny of mine. Um, I don't think we want you to play our games anymore. Hey, that's not nice. I think Buddy should be allowed to play. Me? Really? Hey. You think I am? Fine, Mr. Tortoise. Bunny can play. Oh, they're so cute. Mm. Our bunnies, not tortoises. Okay. I'm sorry that all my friends are imaginary and my pets, but you know, sometimes if I could socialize, it would be easier for me. We don't want you to ever leave the bedroom. This is the best place ever. Oh, I won't, Mr. Tortoise. I will never leave you. That's the spirit. Who needs school? Who needs social interactions? Oh, I. Oh, I can't wait to see those two make out. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a new schoolhouse rock song. Don't ever make out. Don't kiss anybody. And keep your hands to yourself. Then you'll grow up happy. All I know is uh, the only song I've ever learned is one I saw off of uh, off of a commercial. Uh, Drink this and die. Oh, sorry. I thought that's all you wanted. Okay. What do you want? I don't even know how to play this thing. Do it, buddy. Let's sing that song again. Here we go. <laughs> we got nothing. 
How about the imagine? How about the imaginary friend sing along? Here we go. Ready? This time in Spanish. Don't now kiss all of those from Las Vegas. Don't, Don't go kiss out. the boy. Get over here. No. no. Don't play spin the bottle, especially if it's glass, because if it points on you, you'll have to kiss it. Hey, you know, there's other songs we should probably sing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, the person who plays the guitar should probably learn how to play it first. Oh my too. god, that, that would be are benefit. you the guys who sing the Don't Kiss a Boy When You Spin the Bottle song? I want to make out with you so bad! Thank Love you, that. thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. Well, come on now, that, that's, uh, that doesn't seem... That's a, you guys go are, ahead. Like, are you ready? famous in 13 countries. God, you guys are yeah. so hot. Which one is the lead singer so I can jump on you? It, don't it's kiss the one with boys. More hair. Don't kiss boys. Just stay home. And you'll be so happy. Just play with your stuffed animals. Never leave your room. Oh, I love that. Good. It's so inspirational. It's just so good for 11 year old sensibilities, you know? Yes. We're yeah, working on other songs I, uh, like when to use exclamations and periods. <gasps> sweep, 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 sweep. Sweep. <laughs> All right, Michael, I think I'm ready to kiss. I think, I think I've got it. <laughs> okay, this is my first time doing it. Um, I've heard the more saliva, the better, right? <laughs> <laughs> is that it did i do it right oh you got my right? fur you got my fur all wet i'm sorry there bunny i didn't mean to get your fur wet i just wanted to show you how much i care about you and that bunnies have real feelings too you can break out into song now Say, we've been meaning to talk to you. We think maybe we should start spending time with other people. <laughs> never. <laughs> I will never spend time with anyone else but you. Uh... Oh no. <laughs> Oh no, Clementine came in. So it's just that even though we're sort of imaginary and bodies, we think we could do better. We think there's other options out there for us. I agree with you. I mean, did you see that kiss? It wasn't the cutest. Mm -mm, it was not. No. And nobody will ever else want to kiss me with these buck teeth. I want to kiss you and only you. I mean, I'm game. I'm really game because I've got no one in my life. I'm very lonely. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> was that my was that my conscious? Yes, yes. I guess I'm, I'm another voice. It's awfully crowded in here, but it's weird that you're so alone. <sighs> well, I guess we've learned today that math is hard. Yes. And yeah. when do you use a period and exclamation point? Do, 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 do. <laughs> do it, brother. Oh, we just started doing a movement piece. <laughs> <laughs> Multiplications for older kids. <laughs> Sing. Yay. Yay. Nice job, team. Nice job. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, don't be hard on yourself. You're great. Uh, 
I arrived like right at the start of that last set. Um, that muted when I wasn't anywhere near it. Um, yeah, I'll play. Hey. 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 Yeah, and Sandy, if you can turn off your camera too, that would be great. I uh, am completely, I'm completely confused here. I I can't even see myself. I don't know what I did. Perfect. Suggestions, anyone? Taco shop. <laughs> Taco shop. No jam. Popsicles. Kindness, being a good friend. Taco shop was Wait. the first one. Yeah, I think yeah. I hit Taco shop. That, yeah. yeah. Being a good friend is good though. Just good advice. Be a good friend at a taco shop. Hey, Emily, um, I know that's fine, I guess, you know, I'm here to get to know you. So yeah. my, this is the, the, the place where my mom and dad used to take me when I was a kid for tacos. And so it, it reminds me of family and belonging and like people who are really important to me. And I'm hoping that you could be in that category. Okay. I just, never mind. I just want yeah. nachos. <laughs> No, no, it's okay. I, I, you know, I'm, I'm not saying no to anything. I'm just, I'm here to enjoy tacos and company and and whatever happens. Uh, and for the record, I, I didn't guess. ask you for something that you could say, hey, sir. Hey, hey, yeah. oh, oh Kevin, you. I'm so sorry. Was this your table? Uh, well, yeah, I was waiting to uh, take their order. Oh, I am so sorry. Oh my god. Dude, I, I keep taking your tables, man. I am so sorry. It's, you know, that's all right. I, you know, the boss keeps telling me I need to be more assertive and. Yeah. Please actually, yell at, we need two witnesses here. Yell at me in front of the, this lovely couple. Please yell at me. This, oh, not, it, hmm? we're not. Okay. We wouldn't care for that. Oh, well, oh I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. You two look so good together i'm 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 getting like married couple vibes you know You're oh like, mm -mm -mm. we're 18 and 17 years old oh oh yeah oh, oh i am whew, i am screwing up yes is... yes you are oh, how was oh, that oh my god oh. Oh my God! Thank you, Kevin. Oh, that is exactly what I needed. All right, do you two want to yell at me as well for mistaking you? you for oh, just like my parents. Oh, Emily, I'm sorry. This oh, isn't gonna work. Oh my God! 
Oh, it's just like you stabbed me. Oh my God, you really hurt me. And wait a minute. Wait, hold up. Just a moment. You just came over here and took my table to be yelled at, didn't you? You've just been doing all of this so that you could be yelled at. You ruined. Sweepity, 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 sweep, sweep, sweep. So, Philip, you know, welcome to the scary side of town where the best salsa is made by hand. Oh my God, thank you for inviting me, Roger. I mean, you, you know I've been wanting to, 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 to try this forever and well, <laughs> find in my dreams reality. <laughs> well, Phil, Philip, I'm glad that you finally crossed over the wrong side of the tracks because, you know, it means a lot. <laughs> it means a lot. I'll be honest, Roger. It's it's not just the salsa. I've I've been wanting a chance to be like get to know you better, like to be a better friend. Oh, you mean like a friend, friend? Like a friend, friend. <laughs> not just an acquaintance, friend. Yeah, I mean, I want to be like like actual friends. Oh, so not just sign the yearbook too good to be forgotten not just say happy birthday on facebook because facebook told me it was your birthday i wanted to say happy birthday to you because i remembered it was your birthday wow that is a spicy enchilada <laughs> welcome to salsa king may we take your order spicy enchilada please and you well, uh i'll have just a cup of the salsa I'm getting a spicy enchilada of my own right now. You don't, oh, okay, fine. They don't pay me uh, enough for this. Okay, one a cup of salsa, one a spicy enchilada. Fill up. Roger. Tell me, I, we got just a little interrupted there. So uh, <laughs> what was that? I, I just wanna be your friend. You just want to be my friend. Before that, we were buds or pals or <laughs> uh, acquaintances at best. Acquainted. Like we were that guy that you worked with five years ago that you keep in contact with on Facebook, but you don't really talk to him in real life anymore. <laughs> but, wow, that's a big step up in commitment. Great, take that step. Wow. I, I've been thinking, you know, now that you've crossed over into the scary side of town, maybe scary. it's time for me to get over my fear. What's your fear? I, <laughs> I could want, I could want a friend to be with me around. I could be, I could be that friends around you. <laughs> and I could be there too. Two ingredients wrapped up in a tortilla. <laughs> we are the salsa to each other gelata. <laughs> Not in a sexual way, but more like friends. Friends. Edit. Uh, <laughs> yes, downtown, uh, two men were shot today outside of uh, Salsa King. Uh, at first, police believed that it was a drive by shooting, but it appears that it was motivated by the singing uh, and or dancing that was occurring. We have a witness here who says they came upon the uh, the scene, yes, sir. Um, yes. You were here when the, yes. the tragedy unfolded. What did you see? Uh, I saw the whole thing. It was like a sexy enchilada. It was like you seem it was proud. Like, it was like you a first date proud. taco, and then you put it in the oven for a little bit longer. You pour some salsa of acknowledgement. Then you open up you have a recipe blog that you're trying to promote. You, yes. You, this yes. was a double murder here in our town, and you seem proud that you were 
a part and of I'm gonna, And I'm going to kill the competition. And I'm, I'm going to kill the competition. Listen, every taco has a romantic story to tell. And this, and this murder that happened had a romantic story to it. It had the romantic stroll of beans. And, you know, you're kind of nervous. You're like, I don't really know this bean I'm mixed with. And then you're saying there was a motivation of a, a maybe a star-crossed lovers or a, yes, a love triangle? Yes, because then this bean saw this fried rice. <laughs> and I'm like, he's like, you know what? I've heard late nights with my girlfriends talking about douchey fried rice. I don't know if I want to walk down the same path. No, can we say douchey? This is a love story. So I, you- I was offended by your attitude, but now I'm, I'm kind of drawn in. Yeah. What listen, was your relationship with, with the victims or the- I was just an audience member. Oh. All right. Yeah. Okay. You're a, you're a, a Salsa King audience member? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Don't you ever just go to restaurants and just have a free story? I... <laughs> right. So, so I'm a. Let's see, Todd. I've been finalizing my new screenplay. It's called Taco Love. It's based on the story that happened at a salsa king. I'm trying to get it on Broadway. I know you're a producer and you can help me. What can you do for me? Well, what you're gonna need is you're gonna need some angel fun. Okay. You're gonna okay. need to get some rich people to come in and give you money. That's okay. Yeah. Always a good way to start almost anything. Good. Right. Now, you're going to need to bring in a hook. You're going to need to have something that you can take to them and say, this is why you should put your money in my show. Okay. Let's see. So what, like a big name celebrity, like in Orlando Bloom or something? actor a, a <laughs> songwriter you need to have you need to have some razzle okay razzle. it's a some dazzle <laughs> wait i have an i have an idea i have an okay. idea that might sell right. this that yes. might sell. what if we just sing you the love song Ooh. like why don't we just sing you the big love song okay. and then you can decide whether or not you want to finance it Okay. Oh, yeah, I think that'll do it. All yeah. right. Hit me. <clears throat> okay. When I was just a young taco, taco, <laughs> and I was just a bean in your imagination. <laughs> <laughs> All I could think of was becoming a hot, sizzling, spicy fajita sandwich. Big hot, spicy fajita sandwich. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Did you say you're looking for this? Is the dance break? <laughs> we go, and a year later at the Oscars. <laughs> Hello, yes. Oh, God. yes. For the best song uh, in a new please, movie comes to I'm, I'm Encore doing... Taco. Yeah! Uh, oh my God. Oh my God. It's happened. Oh God, it took so long, but it's finally happened. Oh my God. Oh, oh my God. You know, this is what happens when you just you stare at people. And you watch them eat tacos, <laughs> and you, you think, oh, this is just going to be an ordinary bean, but then you add a little hot sauce, and you ask for a yeah. little extra side. Of, yeah. I'm sorry, my mom's here. But you ask for a little extra side of queso, and you realize that that queso was there for you all along. What are you talking about? I can't take it anymore. <laughs> okay, I'll keep talking. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Did you see? They turned our life into a musical. And our 
<laughs> oh, what Philip. <laughs> Philip, our blocked? ghostly selves are looking over. I know. Just, we're so much more handsome in our Broadway versions. Well, you know, you're a pretty good looking guy for a friend. Kevin. You're you're a okay looking dude for a more than more than an acquaintance. More than a friend of a friend. You know, I feel like because we were cut short in our lives, we were unable to actually become friends, consummate our friendship. We have all the turn now. We didn't even get to share the Coca-Cola or the tamarindo or the horchata. Fortunately, here in Taco Heaven, Dalton is available for free. <laughs> taco Heaven. Let me, let me sing to you about Taco Heaven. Oh, yes. Please do. Here in Taco Heaven, <laughs> you can have what you want. <laughs> or Coke with ice. Here in Taco Heaven. You can have your choice, and you'll stay forever. That your friends are noise. <laughs> wow, I feel so noise. Thank you. You, you make me feel that way. Although, there's someone with something the gun over here. Taco I didn't hear what heaven. you said. Taco heaven. We'll be friends for Welcome to Taco Heaven. May I take your order? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm just gonna, you know, order a cup of salsa because I'm getting my own spicy enchilada right now. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh God, it's these guys again. I'm just gonna watch. I'm an audience. Uh, member. Cup of salsa. Philip, those wings, uh, and by that I mean the ones sprouting out of your back. You know, uh, they're real good wings. I admire them. Here, they taste better in barbecue sauce. Oh, uh, oh, okay. It's okay. Hey, you, back. This is taco hey, heaven. Hey, Emily, I hope I hope you're not mad. I bring you to kind of like a shitty part of heaven. <sighs> you know, there's so many other options. There's so many other places that we could go it's heaven we can literally do whatever we want <laughs> you know this, um this is where my parents entered purgatory and so it just reminds me of following in their angel footsteps because mm, mm, mm here's the thing is we're we died we're in heaven now yeah. uh you know it there's sort of like no, nothing left to to lose so i'm gonna go to the nice part of heaven Okay. Um, and you know, you can, you can stay or you can, you can come with me, but I don't think this is going to work. I'm just saying. Oh, okay. I want to Hi, welcome to the nice part of heaven. Uh, yeah. we have, uh, 17 different varieties of pizza. Hey, Kevin. Oh crap. Is this your table again? Yes. <laughs> oh. Yes, it is. Uh, oh, heaven, dang! Uh, so uh, I'm so sorry. I'm uh, my wings are all a flutter right now. Uh, we we all understand. We all understand. Let me sing you a song about how embarrassed I am. <laughs> <laughs> I am a fool. I am so dumb. I walk all over you, Kevin. If I could be like anyone in town or country, I'd be you. Is that like a white menu? Hey, I'm singing a song here. Okay. Sorry 
for the interruption. But Kevin, I think you're great. Sweep, sweep, sweepity sweep. <laughs> I didn't mean to pimp you out, Fastino. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's like two years ago, Neil coached the musical team I was on. So it's really. And I've known Tim for a long time too. So this is like a huge reunion. Yeah, that's, awesome. that's why I was like, I want to get in on this. Why am I not here? <laughs> All the songs are good. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm down. Oh, yeah. Definitely. I'm in. That'd be cool. I do couldn't you... hear your keyboard pretty much at all, but I definitely want to Correct. do a musical improv set. No. No, it was very quiet. No, not very quiet. Really. That's why singing was tentative at best. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but like, I wasn't sure if it was going to get louder. I thought it was just like background. Yeah. But the feeling between in those songs was beautiful. <laughs> 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 that romance. That, that, uh, Oh really? Oh god. I just want I just want you guys to know that it inspired me to make this unicorn cake while you were performing. So I came out here and just whipped that out just while the Wow. Dang. Well okay, like that was actually of nailed my, it. My fourteen year old daughter made that, but but the taco the taco song inspired it. Taco razzle. Great. Uh, there are five of us, I think. Well, Sam, uh, when we come back, can you make sure you uh, start my video? Thank you. All right. He's here. Uh, we're just gonna rip through like a 10 or 12 minute set since it's kind of late. Um, all we need, I'd like maybe three people to help us get a suggestion, um, either audibly or on the chat. Um, one, like name a musical artist. Uh, Moby. Oh no. I heard Dana Moby. Sarah. I heard Moby first. Moby. <clears throat> Let's, uh, someone else give us like a song or a lyric from Moby. Is any of his top 50 or 60 songs that he did. Look at us, uh, we're beautiful. I don't know What's that about beautiful? Look at us, we're Look beautiful. Look at us, we're beautiful. Look at us, we're beautiful. That will be our inspiration to get us started. And I think we will all kind of click off our videos if we're not on stage. So um, uh, tell me again what that quote, Look at us, we're beautiful. Yes, look at us, we are beautiful. Okay. J uh, okay. Jamie, can I make sure that you're that we can hear you? Yeah, can you hear me now? How's that? Yep. Yeah, I think we're all good. All right, here we go. Look at us, we're beautiful. Oh my god! Oh my god! I wow. I never noticed how like how pretty I am. That's weird. Carolyn, oh my goodness. Carolyn, yeah. Everyone notices how pretty you are. Oh my God, thank you. I, I'm kind of insecure about it because I'm not really sure, but I think over spring break, I really came into my own. Carolyn, I know what happened I mean, over spring break, okay? I follow your Instagram and- Yeah, I got, 
Yeah, I saw. I got yeah. a I got a full redone. I got a full full new face. Yeah, and Josh paid for it. Is that is that true? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I know yeah. that I'm not with him anymore, but uh -huh. it, it feels like as my friend, yeah, it's weird to see my ex paying for things for you. I just want to I want to be honest right now, while the okay. elephant is in the room. And I appreciate that. And I'm going to do my part as well and pick up the elephant poop because I feel that you are uh, like the elephant pooping on my relationship with Josh. Just wow. saying. It's a relationship. Yeah. Oh yeah, we we've gone we've gone almost uh, the full way. He's touched my shoulder, and I think it's getting serious. You still touch my shoulder. Yeah. I'm going to be a bigger person here, and I'm not going to end our friendship. Tag them both out. Bring in anybody else. So, I mean, I, like, pay for her to have all this work done. You know what I mean? Like, because I want her to look hot, right? For sure. No one wants to date, like, a, you know, like less a, hot. Yeah, you know? So, I pay for her to have all this stuff, and she's like, yeah, you can touch my shoulder. And I'm like, I just bought you fucking triple D's, you know? She wouldn't even let you touch like her neck? No, nothing. Not even just like a... Like, oh, you can caress me like some kind of freaking Jane Austen heroine, you know? It's weird. She won't let me Dude, that's touch crazy. Her. My girl, she's got this big thing about ankles. She's always like, let me see your ankle. I like that really knobby part. And I'm like, what? Dude. Look at this. Not that. I feel like they've been watching too many period pieces or something, you know? Like, for sure. Period your life off of little sure. women. Oh my gosh, yeah. Thanks a lot, little women. Now I have to be what your Lori? Stop! Oh, no, this is pressure. Essential. These chicks are, man. The I, don't know. I, live, I, I, I gotta be honest, though. I kind of like the whole sensitive thing. The sensitive And a work friend of theirs mask. And then a friend of mine. Well, it was like a work friend. Um, and she's from all of her, really. Oh, I was going to meet her and her husband. She's talking to me in the other room. I keep hearing something. I'm like, Mom, stop. I'm talking to my boy. Yeah, so, anyway, I got to be honest. I don't get to fuck, you know? Like, I want to smash, but I like all the talking. Dude, that's crazy. I'm not even trying to do that. If we're being honest, like, I think maybe... It would be cool to get to know someone for who they are on the inside. Oh, you might be right. Tag both out. Tag uh, Zach back in. I guess we have to talk about your enormous breast because you didn't even bring that up. <laughs> oh. oh my god! I I was wondering when you were going to say something. It's just I mean I don't know. It, it, you're a little bit late for puberty to suddenly hit, so I'm assuming. I know it was taking too long, so I was like, I might as well just hurry up the process, right? Wow. Why wait? Why wait? You know, I, got, I got to say, if, if you are getting him to spring for things that big, you know what? Yeah. You do you, you go for it, because I could never get him to buy anything. Hey, guys. Sorry, I'm just getting here. We have some casting changes for the play. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you are no longer in the chorus. That, am I getting? You're getting moved up to the big leagues. Yeah, you're going to be the lead now. Okay. You are our ingenue, Clarissa. It is um, uh, kind of a Jane Austen take on Greece. Um, and then um, okay. Am Amanda will be moving back into the chorus. Um, what? Yeah, <laughs> pending further, you know, developments physically it was just you know something kind of came to me this morning and i was thinking about it and i see i, I see her in an ingenue rule it's the huge breast isn't it we need to sell tickets well i guess i better get to the dressing room and unlearn my lines <laughs> great Thank you.
tag Brady back in. <laughs> you will not believe this. My oh, girl, man. she just got pushed to the chorus. Yo. Hey, but listen, you know what they say. There's no small actor. No, wait. No, that's not right. Who's winning? There's no, some no actors small. are kind of little. Not gonna lie. Yeah. Not gonna front. No, that's... Uh, that's actually, it's right. not really a competition. It's just... um. Well, this was an improv jam, so we had all these people from all over the country um, who were just grouped in teams, and the team just like a 15-minute like set. Like, to set. It wasn't a competition. It wasn't a competition. Improv, it was just basically it's just a bunch of scenes that, that, are that are just made up. Community. And, um, and they're just made up. Uh, I was on team two. I was on two. team two. Uh, luckily, I wasn't the first team to go. I wasn't the first team to go. I screwed up the technology. Team two was crazy. Okay, I got it now. All right. It's... Felt okay. a little more comfortable that way, but yeah, no, not competition. I'm sorry, uh, not, not like who's on. That's that's competitive. Yeah, I thought for a minute that's what we were doing. It's like a speakerphone going on. Like, oh, this is a, it's a different kind of improv. Eroy, Eroy, what's going on? Sorry about that. Yeah. Um. Do you guys need a refill on coffee? Oh. Yeah. What? No. 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 Yeah. No. No more caffeine. You're right. You're right. Okay. Thanks for I'm not rushing. Not Russian. Okay. So, anyway, I kind of forgot what we were talking about, yo, but you know, you said your, oh, you said your girl got moved back to the chorus line. Yeah, she's in the chorus now. Like she, she literally has one line. It's memorized. She goes, help. <laughs> That's it. That's it. But you know, it's a lot you could do with that line. Oh, Is it help ahead. like, you know, like King Kong is carrying you up a building, right? Mm -hmm. Or is it help like, you know, somebody is, you trapped in a panic room and you don't want to let anybody know that you're yelling for help. No, it's like she was working at a bakery and then someone ran past and took a piece of bread and she was like, help. Ooh. So like the stakes are low. Right. Well, you know, I don't know if this is related, but Carolyn got moved up to the lead. Dang, that's good for you. It's good. I don't want her to get a good hit. So, you know, really cheer me up, honey. Oh. Oh. Oh, hey. hey. Sorry. Sorry, girl. Let me see your ankle. My what? Show me that ankle. No, stop. Stop no, trying to look at my ankle. Hard. I'm tired of it. You you even named it, Lil Pete. Stop. Buy me some breasts. Hmm? Buy me some breasts. Like chicken breasts? <laughs> no, I, I, I need to get... Um, I, I think it's the only way for my acting career to continue because I'm going backwards right now. And, and I think the one thing that's holding me back is that I have only average size breasts. Have you factored in like your talent? <laughs> <laughs> wow I mean like we're in 10th grade like Amanda like there will be a time for big breast and it's sophomore year of college I know everybody tells me to wait they say wait to, to, to make such a, a life altering change but, but I feel like if I don't get on the track now and I don't start getting these big roles now then by the time I'm a sophomore in college, I'm going to be considered a chorus person. And that's there's, not nothing, there's nothing wrong Me. with chorus. Wipe. Like, Wipe. The chorus is like. Wipe, Lucy. Uh, women, this is college. And this is Kappa Alpha Alpha Data. And we take only the most serious women into our sorority. Yeah. Take this very seriously. This is called rush for a reason. We need to hurry? No. Are we late? Are we late for something? Oh no. Oh my God. It's it's the first day. I can't be late. Oh, you guys are first generation. No, your parents didn't go to college, huh? Okay, no. Rush is when the sororities pick you guys. Right. Oh, yeah. Uh, Kendra, can you tell them what's expected of them during this week and how we will be judging them? Um, yeah, so 
first of all, you have to be serious about Kappa Alpha Alpha data. It has to be your main priority at like all times. Secondly, Good. your grooming must be on point. Like if it's humid outside and your blowout starts to frizz, you are out. Oh. Uh, okay. Sister, uh, hygiene, yeah, God, country, family, volleyball. Right. Wait. Wait. I. You go. I don't. I. I. I forgot my question. Well, I just. I'm a tabletop tennis player. I've never played volleyball. I. Yeah, I played ping pong before. Is that kind of the same? Um, it's like tabletop tennis, but it's a little less cool. Oh, okay. Again, sorority, hygiene. And These are hygiene. things that we're really focused on. Does tabletop mm -hmm. tennis come with a mini skirt, you guys? Do you get to wear a cute uniform? I, I mean, depending on how I'm feeling that day. Yeah, sometimes it's just like a pants day. Like sometimes you just need a little security, you know? Like sometimes you just and need it all in. I Cut also to the have final a interview with one of the uh, candidates. We were very impressed with you. Um, but there were some, there was a faux pas. And I think that you're aware and I don't think we should let the elephant go wandering into the corner without talking to the elephant. Found out about my elephant. <laughs> yes. We don't allow pets, and they're not very becoming of a young lady. Little boys play with animals. You're becoming a woman. You're blossoming as a cad. As a what? Kappa alpha alpha data. Oh, I thought you like froze. I thought you were like cat. It's cat. cat. It's one and a half syllables. Well, listen, if you can't handle a free spirit like me, who likes to wear pants, play tabletop tennis, and may or may not own an elephant that actually kind of owns me, then I guess you're right. I'm not for CAD. And you should really talk to my other sister because cut and dry, she is perfect material for you guys. We might be in touch. Um, a, a sister said that you wanted to talk. Uh, Is this about the accident in the hallway? It'll never happen again. I swear. I, I, I just, I, I tried to hold it during the meeting, and I just couldn't hold it anymore, and I just had to go. Tell us again what happened in the hallway. I, 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 I had to go to the restroom, and I just held it and held it and held it for the meeting, but then I just had to go. And you stopped holding it. Real ladies don't have bladders, God. Oh. Mind over matter. I'm sorry. I'll get better. I'm so I'm so sorry. I hope this won't I hope this won't um I hope this won't uh, ruin my chances to get into the sorority. Will it? Yes. Oh no. <laughs> Oh no, my mom's gonna be so disappointed that she was the cat. Sleep, 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 sleep. Well, this is the, uh, this, well, it's the safari. It used to be a safari, and now we just let people drive through and pick formerly wild animals <laughs> and take them home. So um, you can choose whichever animal you feel like represents you. you Fill out a couple of papers and take home your your pet. Y'all got any chimpanzees? Uh, uh, I think we just got rid of the last one on Tuesday, uh, but they they come back a lot. They come back a lot. So. They, they return? Yeah. Well, people realize that they're like toddlers and they never. Oh, you take them back. back. It's like a foster home. Yeah, that's a good way of put. Ah, we are do gooders. Ex Excuse me, madam. This chimpanzee ripped off my face out like a full refund. Yep, no problem. That's wow. just head on back to customer yep. service. We'll take care of it. Thank you. My face is falling off. Yep, yep, wow. that sounds about right. I've never seen a cheekbone before. 
Yeah, that's sadly not my first. So uh, without a, well, you know, we've got that chimpanzee. If you want that one, he'll be all processed and ready to go. Yeah, yeah, I, I would say that I am hesitant to take that particular chimpanzee. I, I really, I want something, here's the thing. Uh, you know, I, uh, I lost my wife. Um, oh. And I just, I, I'm so lonely at home right now. Okay, all right. I want something that needs me. With a little personality that can, you can kind of get to know. Yeah, and preferably. You uh, say you needed something with personality? Riley. <laughs> hey, Riley. Hey. I'll, I'll several questions. Yeah, I'll let you two <laughs> introduce yourselves and get to know one another. Hello. Hey, so you're looking for someone with personality. Lucky for you, I think I have some. You have something. Um, I'm Derek. And what? Derek. Derek? Derek. You know, I had an uncle named Derek. He was a crazy fella, always licking his own armpit. Wow, that's impressive. What can you I do not recognize you as a species. What? Yeah, I, I'm most. I've had dogs mostly, and so I just want to, you know, uh, you seem nice and different, um, and I'm interested in potentially continuing this. Uh, however, I, uh, I just want to let you know that I'm going to have a lot of ignorance that will come out. Derek, you'll be the not first of many, and and just so you know, if you've ever heard of a chupacabra. But put some wings on it, that's pretty similar to what we are. Oh, wow. Yeah, I love Star Wars. Yeah. I think it's about our time. Our time. Thank you, guys. Thanks. Yay. 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 <laughs> Yay. Well done, well done, Casey. Well done. Woo. Yay. 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 Do Sandy. Yay. Unmute Sandy's Yay. Yeah. 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 I didn't mean to talk over your whole uh -huh. improv. <laughs> you it's fine. I have no idea. We don't have chat on here. Y'all fly over us all the time anyway. It's okay. I have to. Where's my sound? I'm going to find it. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, come on. Stay there. I've never played that before. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Yeah, which one is That's that? It's new to me. How do you play it? Uh oh, uh oh. I don't know what speaker view is, but I'm, I'm on a, I'm, I'm on an iPhone. I don't know if that helps. Oh, is that, that's different. Okay. Oh, I can't see myself at all.
Yeah, uh, we just opened up submissions for the KC Improv Festival, which is scheduled for August. So we're very optimistic that it will happen. A video in a pandemic situation. Um, Faustino, that's how we know Faustino. Lots of people have, um, you know, have been to our festival and uh, should be in at the time. It's our 20th annual festival. Oh. So we're trying to make it a big, uh, big deal. If you submit and we don't wind up doing the festival, obviously we're going to give everyone's money back for the submissions. So. Um, that's it. Thank you, Faustino. Thank you. Long sword. <laughs> They call me the long sword because I'm totally into broads. <laughs> they call me the long sword because I'm incredibly unbalanced. <laughs> <clears throat> They call me the long sword because I, I have killed people, but it's been a long time. <laughs> they call me the long sword because I'm super sharp. <laughs> they call me the long sword because my wife goes by battle axe. Oh. They call me the long sword because I love to go blading on the weekends. <laughs> they call me the long sword because I love to see my hilt swing. <laughs> what is a long sword? Uh, uh, they call me the board game. They call me the board game because I get around. <laughs> They call me the board game because usually after a couple hours, people are so pissed off with me. They call me the board game because I have a lot of rules and get pissed if you don't follow them. They call me the board. Sorry. They call me the board game because I only play with three or more players. Yeah. <laughs> they, they call me the board game. They call me the board game because I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> they, they call me the they board game. The, they call me the board game because I got a monopoly on everything. They call me the board game because you make me so little upset I just fall into pieces. <laughs> they call me the board game because everybody takes a spin. They call me the board game because I am they, hours of family fun that will end in a dispute. <laughs> they call me the board game because I'm risky and like to roll the dice. <laughs> yes, uh, they call me the rug, R U G rug, uh, because I'm a walk. I'm a I'm a walkover. <laughs> they, they call, call me, me the, the rug. rug. No, you go. <laughs> They call me the rug. <laughs> they call me the rug because every weekend my grandma takes me outside and beats me with a with a uh, with a broom. <laughs> oh, that's way better than mine. Wow. They call me the rug because I tie a room together. Uh, oh. They call they you call me the I'm a rug be a I'm because I help build up static electricity. They call me the rug because I just like to. Lie around all day. They call me the rug because people like to walk all over me. 
Oh. They call me the rug because I like to trip people. <laughs> they call they me the call rug me the because rug. I, can, I, have, I have Diet Coke stains all over me. <laughs> <laughs> they call, call me, me the, the rug, rug because... Oh. Call me the rug. <laughs> call me the rug. Can I finish call mine? <laughs> They call me the rug because I'm too cheap for Rogaine. <gasps> oh, God. <laughs> um, uh, bat. What? Like bat. baseball bat. Oh. That you swing? <laughs> <laughs> that was my best impression. They, they, they call me the bat because my, when I was a kid, my dad called me Slugger. <laughs> They call me the bat because I like to hang upside down. <laughs> they call me dark. the bat because I like to do it in the dark. They call me the bat because I there's no guarantee you're going to get to home base. <laughs> they call me the bat because I'm a the swinger. They call me the bat because I'm from New Louisville. <laughs> they call me the bat because I like to hit balls. <gasps> they call me the bat because I live under a bridge. <laughs> <laughs> they call me the bat. They call me a bat because I. They, they call me a they, bat because I like it when people choke up on me. <laughs> they call me a bat because I am most likely to give you rabies. They call me a bat because I haven't been picked up since Little League. Oh. <laughs> nice. Wow. That was so much fun. Yeah. Thanks for doing this, Fustino. Yeah, this is great. No, thank uh, you. Yeah, this is so much fun. Right. Yeah. Yeah, it's a good time. <laughs> Sandy would like her camera back on. Yeah. Oh, definitely. So, so Green Town isn't an option. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> <laughs> Come hang out at our one stoplight, man. It'll be great. <laughs> yeah. Um, submissions are open for San Francisco Improv Festival through, it's going to be extended, but probably at least June. And uh, the festival's in September, so go ahead and submit. Yeah, if anyone wants to nerd out on musical improv, uh, the Musical Improv Shop Talk podcast just released its uh, seventh episode of the second season. Uh, that's pretty much where we got interrupted by uh, by the virus, but um, uh, if we're we're available, so check us out. Yeah, they're great. We got some great guests in that podcast too. Which, what's that? Um, we got some great uh, guests in that podcast too. Oh yes, Brian Brian is has been a guest. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, hey, um, uh, I'm trying to bring up a new podcast, but uh, my old podcast is still on iTunes. It's uh, my name program, the Alex Kramer program. Ben Amiri has been on it graciously. Uh, I talk to a lot of improvisers, have uh, do a little improv talk and also just life talk. Mm -hmm. 
it's like my chance to get to know a lot of people in uh, the Pittsburgh community. We have so many funny fucking people. Sorry to swear, but uh, <laughs> so yeah, so I'm trying to bring back um, uh, the podcast again or a new name because the theater I was doing it had to uh, close down for a bit, but uh, I'm trying to bring it back, do the same type of stuff. But uh, the old episodes are still on iTunes, Alex Kramer program. Yeah, I just thought I'd throw that out there. <laughs> it's good. It's good. It's worth listening to. Yeah. Oh, mm-hmm. oh thank you, Chris. I like it. I like it. Yeah. What's that? No, I was just saying I like Alex's show. Oh, mm-hmm. I know Chris. We used to perform <laughs> at the same theater. Chris is hilarious. Thank you. It, do you guys think maybe? Uh, do you guys think maybe you could post like the groups and things you're affiliated with, like in Faustino's line, like the thing that he has started, just to kind of put it down in the comments below. I've never played them. That way we can look them up. Yeah, I don't know. What if? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, uh-oh. What about? I don't know if of you, but I'm, I'm, on a, I'm, I'm on an iPhone. I don't know if that would help. Oh, it's not good. It's just different. Okay. Uh, that was weird. That was me, but that was from earlier. It was like recorded or something. Because <laughs> I, I said that like 15 minutes ago. Weird. That was very weird. But yeah. <laughs> I would like to give a shout out to Sunshine, which has been in Michigan for two days in a row. Uh, Sunshine. (laughs) Absolutely. I get the link through the Second City Music Jammers Facebook page. Hey, Fastino. I keep getting a message in the chat that Sandy is trying to get her camera on and says she can't. Yeah. <laughs> I still can't see myself though. What am I doing wrong here? I I can see myself. Yay. Anyone want to do like getting to know you things? Like just like get into each other's souls. I love that. Just like that? I don't know. Sounds good. Yes. Wow. Hey. 
you so yeah. much, everyone. NJ, getting Thank to know you. you would be fun. Bye. Yeah, like, it could be really simple yeah. stuff, like biggest fears, worst childhood memories, you know, something oh. simple. Oh, I'm uh, <laughs> no? <laughs> yeah, that's that. Yeah, definitely. Or a different question. <laughs> 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 Well, yeah. tough. They all left. <laughs> I already changed into my PJs because it's like eleven thirty here. <laughs> it is eleven thirty our time, isn't it? Yeah. Who's in my time? California. <laughs> They're classy PJs, though. I mean, they look good. It's a good look. <laughs> Flannel. Flannel's always a good choice. <laughs> Flannel's the improv choice. You could do like a screenshot, like on a on a normal computer. I'm just doing this. <laughs> yeah, I'm just staying like this. If you're on a Mac, uh, control control yeah, shift and because, F3. And because it's 11:30, uh, all those third graders are in bed by now, plus you know. <laughs> okay, where are you? Where are you from? <laughs> Yep. Appreciate you putting this together. Good job. Thank you. Yeah, thanks. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Yay. It was such a fun time. Yeah.